Today we'll be checking out an indoor security camera. YouTube, welcome to the channel. Like I said, we have an indoor security camera. This is from Conoco, the wireless IP camera, 1080p. Um, I believe it's listed on their website as a pet baby monitor camera. It can be used for any of those or an indoor security camera. Okay, just a disclaimer, uh, Conoco did reach out to me and they sent me this uh, for free for me to try it out and review it. They didn't leave any stipulations of the, you know, I have to give a good review. I'm just giving you my honest review of this product. Okay, here is the camera itself. As you can see, it's very small. So throughout this video, I'll probably be referring back to the Blink Minis. Um, this is a camera that I've had, actually I have four of these in my apartment. I've had these for about a year now. So I'll be comparing it to these you know, how well does this work compared to these? Because this is a super popular one. You can pick this up at Best Buy and stuff. Um, for this camera here, I will leave a link in the description to their website and a link to the Amazon uh, site where you can pick this up. Just so you're aware, when you click that Amazon link and you'll see the camera, you'll probably notice a difference. It's the exact same camera. It looks exactly the same. It's just the name on it is gonna say Vimtag rather than Conoco. And I reached out to Conoco to find out, you know, cause they sent me that Amazon link, you know, what's going on with that. And this is their response. As it said, Vimtag, Vimtag brand is also an independent operating brand of our company. The video description only needs to mention that the product belongs to Vimtag brand and attach the Vimtag Amazon link. So just so you know, it is from the same company, just has a different name on it. So Conoco must own Vimtag too. Okay, so reading the box here. View via your phone, which you can. You'll just download the Conoco app and then you control your camera from that. Let's see, HD video, it records in 1080p, two-way audio, so you can talk through this just like you can on the Blinks. You know, it has a speaker on it, so you talk into your phone and you'll be able to talk and hear whatever's going on in the room. It has motion detection. Um, the difference between this one and say the Blinks, the Blinks have motion detection too. They'll pick up motion and start recording. This does too, but this also turns, I believe it's 355 degrees. So not all the way around, but pretty much almost all the way around. So when it's on and you walk into a room or your pet or whatever, someone comes into your room, it'll turn and pick them up and follow. So that's a really cool feature of this. So it'll track, it has sound detection too. So it'll pick up noises, you know, if it's on say just sitting in the room and it hears a noise over here, it'll turn and start videoing where that noise is coming from. So as you can see, the products use home security, office security, elder care, baby care, pet care, and store surveillance. Can be great for any of those devices. For me, I have it set up on my kitchen counter. And like I said, I have, the blinks too, I have these throughout the, the, uh, my apartment too. If anyone comes in, they're caught on many different cameras. But the great thing about this one, I have it set up on my kitchen counter. The main reason I use it and the majority of my blinks too, the only one I have set to record is the blink at my door. So if anyone comes in the door, it'll pick up recording because if you have, I have two cats. So if you have your camera set to record every time there's motion, it'd be recording me every time I walk around and record the cats. You can set it up like that. I'd recommend only do it if you're gone because otherwise you're gonna have file after file after file. Um, the reason I like this, I have it set on my kitchen counter. And like I said, it can turn. So let me let me show you. So with the blinks, I can only see where it's shooting. So say I have one in my bedroom shooting this way or one in my living room, I'm only gonna catch what's in the view of that. So a lot of times when I go on, I wanna check on my cats. What are they doing? Are they getting into trouble? Where are they at? So if they're not in front of the camera, then I can't see what they're doing. To where with this one, if they're anywhere in that room, I'm gonna find them. And there is a look at the camera there, you know, your, your footage on your phone. So then I can just turn the camera just by sliding on the screen here. And you see it's, and then I can rotate it up. So it not only can turn, it can rotate too. So let's, Let's go up and check out the ceiling. There we go, as you see. So now it's on me. Let's bring it back around here. And you can bring it down. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. I'm gonna go down, not up. 
So as you can see, like I said, I have that set on my counter so I can scan the room. I can find out, okay, are they pretty much, I can cover, like I said, it turns 350, 355 degrees. So almost 365. So you pretty much can cover the entire room. And I noticed on their website, I think it was their website, or maybe it was the Amazon site. Let's check out. So here is their website here. So it's conoco.com and you can see they have a bunch of different uh, items. And so here's the one we have right here. This one looks like it comes, uh, that's I think just the baby monitor. I like this one better, like I said, cause I got more rotation up and down and spins. I think this one just turns. So if you purchase it through Conoco's website, $58.99, you either get it in white or in black. And so smart sound detection. So you can have it set up in your baby's room and if the baby wakes up and starts crying, it'll start recording. So that's a great feature there. Same thing with like your dog. And it must have been on the Amazon site that they had it, which I didn't even think of doing this, which is a great idea, is they had it hooked to the ceiling like that. Now, let me rotate it down, which I'm going the wrong way. You see the camera's coming down. So you can have it up on the ceiling and then cover the whole, pretty much your whole room. You know, maybe if you set it in like a corner, then it's gonna cover everything in there. So that's the coolest feature of this is the fact that it turns, it goes up and down. There's not much in a room that's gonna hide from this camera there. And like I said, night vision too. So let me show you a couple clips here. Okay, so here's just a clip of me in my kitchen, just playing around with it, turning it, as you can see. Um, depending on the light, now it's 1080p, as you're gonna see in that, you can see it, well, it's not super clear. Again, it's gonna depend on the lighting in the room. If it's really lit up well, then you're gonna get a cleaner, you know, clearer picture where my, you know, I have had colored lights going on, it's late at night, it's kind of dark, so it's a little pixelated because it's using the IR a little bit to enhance the light, but still. You can see everything, decent, decent view of everything. And I think as, you know, it pixelates a little bit as you're turning it, if you leave it sitting in one spot, I think it focuses a little better and the picture gets a little clearer. Okay, now let me show you one. So here is with the night vision and you can adjust this. When I first got it, there's a brightness setting in there. Go in and adjust your settings if you, Look at your your footage in the night when it was, it was dark. If it seems really dark, like when I first got it, it was just lit up like in a small area. Wherever the camera's facing, just a small circle was lit up. I'm like, wow, the night vision on this isn't very good. Not no nowhere near as good as this. It's because I had the brightness too low. So as I turned up the brightness, it lit up the entire room. Well, for the camera. In the room, this room is completely dark, pitch black in there. So let's play it and show you. I mean, pitch black room, it looks pretty good. I mean, you're gonna be able to see whatever's in there. And again, if there was motion or something, it would pick it up. I don't have it on to record, but just, just to give you an idea of what the night vision looks like with this device. And just look, I'm just checking out the Amazon site to see what the price is right now. And this price could vary depending on when you're watching this video. As of right now, the one on Amazon that's under Vimtag, $44.98, so it's 10% 10, 10 off right now. There's a sale on it right now. So you can do cloud storage where you're gonna pay a monthly fee to have your files stored to cloud storage, or let me just unplug it so it stops spinning here on me. Um, just put a micro SD in here. Just pop it in here. It holds up to, you can use up to, I believe it is a 128 gigabyte SD card in there. Then you don't have to pay the monthly fee your stuff is gonna be stored on there and you'll be able to access it all on your phone and you can download those files. So if you, your videos be stored to you like your photo album in the Conoco app. And then if you wanna transfer those and share them with people, you just, you just click on the video and there'll be a little option to save it to your phone's library. So then you just save the video to your library and then you can share it with whoever you want. So great features, super easy to do. Love the fact that this camera spins and goes up and down. My cats can't hide from me anymore. Well, in my living room, they can't hide. I need more of these in each room. 
so I can watch them wherever and find them so they're not hidden from me. So there you go, the Conoco, or like I said, if you get it off uh, Amazon Vimtag, same company, I mean, under the same parent company, same device, just different name on it. Really good camera. Leave it in the comments below if you've got it. What did you think of it? And how did you use it for? Did you use it to monitor your pets? Baby, maybe as a security camera. And like I said, I think I'm going to look at, even though my ceilings are really, really high, 16 feet high, so it's gonna be hard to get it up there. But if I had lower ceilings, I probably would mount this up somewhere so I could scan the whole room. Really cool device. So there you go. Like I said, I will leave links in the description to their website, the Conical website and to the Amazon one. So there you go. If you've enjoyed this video, smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. And I'll see you next time.